Good morning everybody, how are we all doing? It is Saturday and it's been nippy outside. Hope you all do fine. If you're new to this channel, hi, my name's Cathy and I like to do videos on fibromyalgia, chronic illnesses and my furry babies and mental health and other life challenges. I have two children that are autistic and one child who has got ADHD, yes, and it's very challenging as well as my own physical needs and mental health and also my furry kids so i have blah, 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 six cats <laughs> i know because there's a crazy cat lady and i have a dog i'm assuming has also got a dog it is a belgian malawa and i don't know why i'm standing like this <laughs> um he has a belgian malawa i have a spring spaniel who is a therapy dog I have my daughter, my eldest daughter is 24, she's autistic and she has two black cats. I have two black cats and um, my youngest has a black cat. Oh, I also have a toy. So it's got six. Yeah. <laughs> crazy cat lady, crazy cat lady. As I've probably known on the, on where I live. I drive up around my furry babies. There I am, my certain human beings and i'm sure i'm not the only one that thinks like that pop a comment in below guys are you the same do you like to be around your furry kids than some human beings plus they don't answer well i can't say they answer back because one of them does sorry you know, if i just sort of put out because the little son saw what showed up um meowing and wanting to get into bella Anyhow, so he's out and he likes to jump on doors and he can open doors. That's the reason why I have to lock my front door, which I do anyway, but more when he's out. Because he jumps on handles and lets himself in. Does, can you let me know in the comments below as well, guys? Do you, does your fairy babies have any talents like that? Um, yeah. So let's get on with this video. So sit back, relax and let's do this. So guys, I thought I'd let talk about fibro talk today and oh my goodness my fibro is affect, affecting me somewhat rotten today. Um one of them be with speech. So if I don't make sense, sorry. Just part of fibro. Secondly, the pain and fatigue. And not only vertigo. And my eyes keep my eyes, my vision keeps going blurry. Does someone else suffer with that? Comment below. Oh, one second, guys. Sorry, guys. My cat thinks he he's a gymnast. A jam, uh, what do you call it? A gymnastic jump. He, he gets up. This is what I mean with sorry. He jumps on handles to let himself into Hannah's room. Well, he's just been caught. And for reason, I've just ran. Well, not ran quickly. Put my phone down and. Went to sit, sort him out. Sorry, I keep going dizzy. And for some reason, I, mean, I feel like my eyes, even though when you're watching this, my eyes don't seem to be, to see all right. But to me, I feel like they're going like cross-eyed and just, they look like one of them, right, this eye here, my right eye, looks like it's going smaller and bigger. <laughs> and my face as well doesn't look great. Anyway, I want Keep putting myself down. Don't ever do that, guys. Thingy. But my vision is really bad. Comment below, guys. What do you, what's your worst symptom of fibro? I know pain and fatigue is one of them. But what I mean is, like, does, is your vision affected? Your speech? My brain fog today is somewhere else because I can't. I have to write down what I'm... Go so... When I want, thought about doing this video, I thought I better write the title down. I better write it down because when it comes to editing, my brain just goes, it has a brain fart. It's like, oh, whatever I've said, I can't remember. So when I do edit, I'm like, oh, did I say that? Oh, oh my gosh, I can't remember saying that. I've got really bad heartburn as well. So, oh. And you know what? I've still not heard anything back from the hair pain clinic. I mean, come on, doctors. I'll, I'll, when did I see them? I'm sorry, my arm's starting to hurt, but if I grab it before like that, you're going to see my finger in the camera. It's, I'll just let Millie out for a quick tinkle. Oh, my, and a poop, because, you know, yeah. 
Anyway, don't worry, I've washed my hands. Uh, I've got a brain fog. What was I saying? It's absolutely freezing out there and it's twinkling. And I need to go and... Yeah, I still got, I didn't get around to doing my hair last night. Oh, that's part, another part of fibro is you just... Your, your personal care just goes out the window. And it's not by choice, you just don't have the energy. Like, I just don't have the energy to physically get in there, wash my hair, wash myself. I just, I drive So in the morning, when I'm feeling like this, I, I've got a pack of baby wipes. I've always got a pack of baby wipes, facial wipes or whatever you want to call them, to hand. And I just, yeah. And when I'm not videoing, because you only see like about 10 minutes of what I've been doing all throughout the day, is I just stop off of I just stay in PJs. Like I've got a jumper on over my PJs. I just because I can't be bothered. Not that I can't be bothered. I just don't have the energy to even contemplate getting dressed. So I'm just sat watching Elk My House is on haunted and then caught some ghosty stuff, paranormal caught on camera. Uh yeah, so that's for me today is I'm gonna relax, I'm gonna try and take it easy and hopefully my vision will get better in a little bit it's a bedtime yeah <laughs> i'm worn out guys i am really worn out I don't, oh, just anyway fibro for you ice finest it's kicking my butt so i've just gone to her asda to get some cat litter all the way there well i'm not to have any great uh however I've never felt so blah, 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 yucky in all my life. The lights were bright. The lights were so bright. My, my right eye keeps twitching out. Sorry. And, yeah. I'm exhausted. Excuse the cat in the background. Again, he just walked. I'm getting muted. Uh, mid month. So they're getting booked. They have, uh, did I book them in? Oh no, I need to book them in. We're getting done this month. And then we won't have any of this, hopefully, stopping them peeing everywhere. So there's no point me decorating just yet. Well, get someone to do it because I ain't got the energy to do it right now. Get someone in, paint the walls. Oh, I might go wallpaper. I know sometimes cats do carry on peeing, but at least it won't smell because I know one of Hannah's cats keeps having a little tinkle here, there, and everywhere. That cat, that cat, <laughs> sooty boo. Anyway, like I said, is it bedtime yet? I've never felt so blooming exhausted in all my life. So, the tea and I, so the other day we got, um, I did put some of that cream on my first day, but it's just not working for me. <laughs> Tom got a steak the other day from Aldi, so he's going to have that tonight. So I'll just grab the chick a chicken. One second, that little critter. Sorry, it's uh, gone preventing from going into Hannah's room. So Tom's having steak and we're having chicken. So I've just put a chicken, you know, those cooking a bag one on a slow cook. And then later on, Hannah will peel the potatoes, dice up the broccoli, and then put it on boil for me. So I don't really do much. I do, however, forgot gravy, so I do go to one of the kids to the shop to get some gravy because you can't have a Sunday, well, it's not even Sunday, it's Saturday, but you can't have a Saturday <laughs> slash Sunday dinner. Because <laughs> I thought it's going to be easy, just bang it in the oven, I don't have to deal with it until later on tonight. Um, and then tomorrow, I've got the mince out that was defrosted yesterday so I'm, that definitely is eating tomorrow so that'll be spaghetti bolognese anyway guys i'm gonna have to go and lay down for a few hours so that'll be me for today and i'm hoping you're all well and not in pain well i won't say not in pain but not in a really bad pain like how i feel right now i feel like i've been dragged through a bush backwards speech is all over the place sounds like i'm drunk and i'm not it's by bro my head feels like i've got cotton wool in there my brain fog is bad pain levels are really high and that blooming cat even though it's meowing lightly the sound just 
it sounds magnet it's like it's magnified and i just pop a comment in the blog guys do you ever feel like that like even the slightest little noise it sounds louder my tinnitus is like something else like it keeps swinging up my door handles uh, a day and stuff like that and I'm still complaining but uh, you know it's life in it fibro just kicks your backside whenever it feels like you could be having a good morning or something and boom kicks you up the butt and then you're like Bleh. you feel like poop anyway guys I'm going to love you and leave you don't forget to hit that like button that subscribe button if you're new to this channel and that notification bell so you don't miss any further uploads and post it up liking and commenting as well i love to interact with you guys and it pushes my videos out to other you people in other different countries or whatever i don't know how it works it's the health room i can never say that word it helps with that anyway see you later guys enjoy the rest of